welcome to the Misfit Squad podcast. Where we invite you to embrace your difference and to discover a spectrum of possibilities and change what's wrong about you into what is strong about you. Hey everyone, welcome to this week's episode of the Misfit Squad podcast. Today we have something super special for you. We are going to do uh, live on the recording and enter, um, an acoustical awakening of being, <laughs> which is the energetic body work that we do. So I'm going to lead it and talk and Trina is going to um, stand back and pretend that she has all of your bodies uh, on tables in front of her and she's going to move around and move the energy with her body the way that we do when we work with um, you guys one on one, when we would work with someone one on one. And we don't know how or why, but the recordings always capture the energy of the change that's being created. So whether you're listening to this today, tomorrow, or a hundred years from when we make it, the energy is all still there. It's all still creating the change for you. And there you go. We suggest don't listen to this while you drive or operate heavy machinery. <laughs> uh, sit down, relax. You can have your eyes open or closed. Um, but don't be, you know, really use this as a, as a moment to like relax and really receive and allow your body to relax. Um, or if you're someone like me who doesn't really like to meditate and needs more active sort of meditation, you could also listen to it while you're walking, but not while you're lifting heavy weights. So yeah, that's our disclaimer. <laughs> All right, so are you ready? I am ready. So just enjoy guys. Okay. So <clears throat> what we're going to work on today is we're going to tune in and connect with our heart center and clear out the barriers, remove and dissolve the heart walls. And we're going to do that uh, as part of that, we're actually also going connect to connect with my herd of horses, my herd here live and still in physical bodies, and my spirit herd on the other side. And they will contribute to and assist us in this acoustical awakening of being. So everyone, uh, if you're going to be sitting down or lying down, sit down, lie down, close your eyes, and Take a deep breath in and exhale. Take another big breath in and as you exhale, feel your body sinking in to the bed or the sofa or the chair. And if you're doing this as a walking exercise, feel your feet. Connect to the earth, feel the roots grow out of them, making you one with the planet and the earth. That is possible even if you're on concrete or tile or marble. Okay, so take another big breath in and as you exhale, ask all your barriers to lower. just seeing them dissolve away into nothingness. Good. We're also just going to ask your awareness, we're gonna ask our awareness to expand bigger and bigger and bigger, all the way to the edges of the planet and beyond. Another big breath in and as you exhale, 
just allow that awareness to expand even more. And if you have any tight areas in your body, let's bring your attention to that. Might be your neck or your back or your stomach or your hips. Bring your attention there and breathe into that place in your body. And as you exhale, just allow it to unlock and unwind and relax. Good. Remembering to keep breathing. Some of you might be experiencing unusual sensations in your body. <clears throat> Feel free to allow your body to move as much as it wants to, and it's okay if your body doesn't move at all. Just allow the energies to permeate every fiber of your being all the way down to the smallest particle of your DNA. Now, let's bring your attention to your heart and your heart center. Some people like to refer to that as their heart chakra. Bring your attention there, big breath in. And as you exhale, just allow that area to expand and fill with lightness. Good. The horses are here with us now and they've moved closer. I energetically can feel them circling around us, contributing their energy and their love and support. So just imagine yourself standing in the center of a herd and you can see a beam of energy or light moving from the heart of one horse into the next all the way around in a continuous circle flowing in both directions between them creating a circle of light and then them flowing a beam of light and energy from their heart into your heart. Just allow that to permeate into your body and relax even more. Now we're just gonna breathe in the heart energy from the horses and as we exhale, expand it even bigger. Make it bigger than the room that you're in, bigger than the building that you're in, and bigger than the planet. Good. Ooh. Now I want you to imagine that you have your own horse each one from the herd standing in front of you with their nose nuzzling your heart center. Just allow them to flow you energy and allow the nuzzling to pick out the places that you've locked your heart up, shut it down, close yourself off to yourself and also to others. Good. Now we're going to bring our attention there again, and you're just going to ask for one molecule that's ready to change and shift. Good. One. 
And we're going to now take that molecule and we're just going to turn it a quarter turn counterclockwise and expand that energy out and expand it some more. And we're just going to imagine the tangles of energy start to untangle and furl open so that they're loose and free and can intertwine and move and are no longer locked in a knot. And we're just going to breathe in more energy, breathe in the energy of the horses. And as we exhale, those entanglements will continue to unwind and unlock. So every time you breathe in, it brings you into your heart center. And every time you exhale, something else unlocks and unfurls and creates more space. It shows you more of the energy of you, your essence, who you are, who you be, and why you're here and what you're here to do. Good. Another big breath in. And as we exhale, we're going to ask the wall, the heart walls that we've constructed to protect ourselves to collapse and dissolve. Expanding that more and more. Acknowledging that they were a great creation that served a great purpose at some times in our life, but that they no longer serve us. And we're gonna ask that that be replaced with awareness. Awareness is the only true protection. Being in who you are and allowing yourself to know and acknowledge your awareness is the best protection and the greatest gift you can gift yourself. So breathing in, and as we exhale, expanding the awareness in our heart center. And allowing the horses as they go back to their grazing pasture to take your troubles and worries, your barriers and your doubts, and just carry them away for you. <sighs> Another big breath in. And as you exhale, send the breath and your energy through every fiber of your being to the smallest particle of every cell in your body. Good. And breathing normally, bring your attention to your body and your feet on the ground, your butt in the chair. You're always connected to the planet. Remember that you can be grounded in the earth. And every time you breathe in, you're going to breathe in more awareness and knowing and more connection to the earth. And every time you exhale, exhale, that is going to infuse your being and your body with those energies. And when you're ready, Open your eyes, move your body, and just be aware of the, the things that come up for you today and in the, in the next 24 to 48 hours. These acoustical awakening of beings will continue to 
contribute to you and change things for your being in your body for like up to three weeks. They continue to work and do more and more and more. So every time you breathe, you'll breathe it in. Every time you exhale, it spans out even more. So pay attention, see what shows up that's different. And if you can just notice that and acknowledge it, it expands and allows even more to show up. Do you have anything to say or add, Trina? Um, just enjoy, and um, you can replay it several times. Um, I'm all like R runny eyes. eyes. Yeah, yeah. Runny eyes from actually doing energy work. Yes. Just en just enjoy it and allow your body and your being to receive. Awesome. So we'll see you next week. Enjoy. Uh, if you have questions or comments, hit us up uh, at possibilitiesunleashedllc at gmail.com or probably easier and faster to reach us uh, on our Facebook page, facebook.com forward slash the Misfit Squad uh, or hit us up on Instagram. You can see us all those places. All right. All right, everyone. Thanks. See you next week. Bye. Bye. Thank you for listening to the show. Our target is to make your awareness easy to use and to acknowledge the power of not fitting in. If you enjoyed this podcast, please subscribe to our channel on YouTube and share it with someone you know. Why fit in when you were born to stand out? Embrace your difference. Join the Misfit Squad.